taken out of meaning. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't mean what it used to be. Like, okay. <laughs> so, um, I, mean, I don't know about you, but that upsets me. That upsets me a lot. So, I think I, I kind of need to break it down and I need to, I need to show people what it actually means. Isn't it? So, if you hear something that you like, feel free to click on that. People say in the movies, and they say in the soaps, boys say to their girlfriends to give them false hope. I'm talking about the thing that Materialism in the passenger seat and wonders why a relationship is cold with no heat. Some of us may see our desired partners and have an accelerator in our chest that speeds up our heartbeat, but a rush of adrenaline won't determine who your heart meets. And a heart can't speak words, so emotions is the speech. Drunken lovers slur their words because they had sex on the beach. And I'm not much of a drinker, but give me a pint of purity. Because some of these girls want to spite my drink with their sexuality and call it that four letter word. <laughs> Put the emotions into words and the words onto paper. I read a love letter. It was called The Songs of Solomon. Tell me if you can write better. You see, I know some girls that are so imperfect, yet they expect to get a man who is perfect. <laughs> Something like agape. Something like agape. Their own flaws are so present like the last days. In the past, they were with the wrong man because they chose to go their heart's way instead of chasing your way. Your spirit can't say anything about getting mistreated by him. Plus, I know guys that don't know deep emotion because they thought lust surpassed it all. So they choose to be players and treat love like basketball. Not knowing that. G-O-D is L-O-V-E, they say that love is blind and the films on TV, but if that was the case, then how would God see you? This world hates so much, so how could its love be true? My soul covers his ears so that hatred can't be heard. I'm on this one woman thing, but my boys tell me that's absurd. It's not, though. Once upon a time, a female earthquake left her world shaken, not stirred, and in her list of priorities, I didn't even come second or third. But with him, I can withstand the tremor. So patiently, I wait for God to bring to me the woman who will truthfully utter that four-letter word. <laughs> 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 